What's up guys, welcome back to another video. And in today's video, Maddie's gonna tell us which trail we're going to do today. Show enough. You heard it right there, show enough. <laughs> <laughs> so today we're gonna be riding show enough for episode 12. And this is one of the trails that does not get ridden very often. There may be some over overgrown grass, stuff like that, but it'll be a good one. So you guys stay tuned for that. And this is episode 12, so we're so not very many videos left. So I hope you guys have been enjoying this journey of me riding and me and Maddie riding some of these trails out here. But definitely check out the rest. But without further ado, let's get started. All right, we also have this new view. Uh, the GoPro is on the handlebars of the bike. So this is something a little different. You guys haven't seen this before, so hopefully it works out. But let's. Let's get started. You right, right, yeah. <laughs> right, it's always right. Let's get started. Show enough. Show enough. <laughs> we'll take it easy at first, but every time I'm going down, I usually I usually take it fast. All right, here we go. Looks good. Rocks. Ooh. Okay. Sand. Watch out. Yeah, some sand.
construction over here. Right, so this is the Cahaba Shoals loop. This is where they intertwine, so we keep going straight. Have you seen any web? All right, guys, uh, really quickly, I wanted to point something out in the video. I just said to keep going straight. So Maddie and I currently are right here in this uh, middle point. Um, but I did say to keep going straight, meaning that we would keep going this way, but that is actually wrong. Uh, I wanted to point out that here it's a little confusing because there's not, there aren't any signs to tell you which way to go for show sure enough. Um, but rea in reality, you're supposed to take left and then go into show sure enough. So you're supposed to go into Cahaba Show's loop for a bit and then go into show sure enough. We ended up coming through here, but it did not really seem like the trail, so we turned back. Um, but I point that out and I have the older map and the new map because show sure enough actually just used to be a small trail that used to connect into Cahaba Shows Loop, but now it has the secondary part, um, which I guess it, it explains why there wouldn't be any signs of Cahaba Shows no, or Cahaba, sorry, Show sure Enough around here and here. Um, but yeah, just so you guys are aware. Make sure to take left if you want to continue the show enough uh, loop and don't keep going straight or take a left otherwise you'll be doing this entire giant loop. Just take a left and within a couple of minutes you'll probably end up seeing the, the entrance of this other trail which is also show enough. But yeah I just wanted to point that out there so you guys don't get lost like we did um, but you know make sure to ride safe and have fun and I hope this helps.
Oh deer, wow. I hope you guys saw that. Deer. I wasn't expecting it at first. Yeah. All right, guys. So that's the end of show enough. Uh, the second part was fantastic. It was super quick, super fast. Honestly, I was going pretty quick, and I love it. You guys already know I, I like the speed and I like the nice turns and jumps. Uh, so this is the end here, and then Maddie's where the entrance is. So Maddie, uh, what are your what are your opinions on the trail overall? Uh, me personally, the the hardest part about it was that it was so long, um, and there were three steep hills where I had to walk up because it was it got pretty tough. But um, other than that, I was able to stay in the third gear the whole time, so it wasn't too bad. There you go. Yeah, I agree. There were some uh, pretty steep hills, but the majority, if you were going pretty fast, you could handle them pretty well. Um, I know the the second part was honestly my, my best so definitely check it out it was a little confusing to get there so in the video I'll go back and edit the, the explanation of how to get there because it can get a little confusing you have to go into Cabo Shoals Loop and then into the second part of uh, Sholnoff but don't worry I'm pretty sure I've already explained that in the video so that's okay but yeah come here check it out and if you guys would like more videos let me know also let me know how you guys like the camera angle it was mounted right on here on the handlebars um but yeah without further ado give it a like give it a comment give it a share and we will see you guys on the next episode peace